Another area where we saw a lot of street flooding, Green Valley Ranch. Uh, the intersection of Green Valley Ranch Boulevard and Tower Road closed overnight after several feet of water piled up. So Eric Lufer rushed to the scene to check it out. He's live now with what he's seeing there. Hey, good morning, Kelly. Thankfully, the water receded around 4 o'clock this morning, just in time for the morning commute. So Tower Road is running smoothly right now. But four hours ago, this parking lot here near the intersection of Green Valley Ranch Boulevard and Tower was underwater. Take a look at this video. I'm pretty much in the same area where I caught this video around 2 o'clock this morning. You can see you can hardly see the parking spaces. About a half foot of water on this parking lot. And then it was Tower Road that was the biggest issue just north of Green Valley Ranch Boulevard. A car was actually stranded in that water. It couldn't get all the way through. That's when police decided they had to close it down. So it was closed for a couple of hours. And then look at the light show. Several bands of storms came through Green Valley Ranch. And I stopped and looked toward the northeast uh, just past DIA. And that's where you saw all of that lightning. And back here live, the only area that still flooded this ditch just off of Tower Road. It's starting to recede as well. The road drying out, that is good news, but wow, a lot of storms came through overnight. I'm in Green Valley Ranch. Eric Lou for 7 News Now.